go. One, and two, three, and four. Okay, camel. This is the last one. I think. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I'm always gonna be doing something. So um, this is appears what I'm gonna be doing for a while. These individuals that stay cognitively active, so uh, continuing to work for a longer period of time, seem to have a lower risk of developing uh, dementia or difficulty with their memory and thinking and reasoning. Continue to be engaged in uh, whatever it is that's enjoyable to you. My parents are retired, but they're busier than ever. They're taking classes at their local university, they're continuing to attend lectures, and they're continuing to stay uh, cognitively engaged and socially engaged in, in their lives. I've always been rather physically active. Okay. Then I have a book club, and I have a garden club, and I have, uh, um, we belong to a theater group. Housekeeping at this stage or this Everyone contemplates their end when they get to be a certain age. You know you're not immortal. And if you can pick and choose, that's not a way to go down that inevitable path to death. The garden is full of all kinds of flowering plants and so forth, courtesy of this idea. <laughs> and we got talking about it. We are very, very blessed. Change. So I never really thought about just retiring. I didn't look at retirement as not doing anything. I just looked at, I was just reinventing what I did. Make sure that you use the core area. You have to extend your arms. Really have to extend your arms. 